Earth science is physics, it's chemistry, it's biology, all rolled into one to study one giant interdisciplinary system, which is like the Earth and the planets. When I was a freshman, I wasn't really sure what I wanted to do, but I knew I was interested in science. I took Human Use of the Earth, which is a class that Professor Bob Chris teaches, and it completely changed the way I look at the sciences. One of my favorite things about the Earth and Planetary Sciences Department is all of the opportunities to study abroad and go on field trips here in the United States as well. Many classes offer field trips as a component of the coursework that help to really complement what you're learning and put it into practice in like a real life scenario. This spring, I will be participating in a field class for undergraduate majors that will take a trip to Spain with a few faculty members to learn about the regional geology of the Mediterranean and learn important field skills. Through the studies and the research that I've done, I found that I'm really passionate about water resource issues and that's what I plan on continuing to pursue research in at the graduate level. I chose EPS because I was excited about the prospect of spending my life outside, trekking around, looking at rocks. Last year I had the opportunity to go to Italy um, for the undergrad field experience trip. Basically how everything with regards to the formation of the Apennine Mountains was connected, like the rock type present in the basin influenced the overall structure of the mountains, which influenced how these really cool caves we saw formed and how the different waves of the mountains coming together, kind of coming apart, was progressing across Italy and it was really, really neat. Research is a really important part of the department and they want the undergraduates to be able to participate. I plan on using my knowledge of earth and planetary sciences to study forest ecology and how forest ecosystems relate and change with changing underlying geology. I'm currently working on a senior thesis in which I am finding the chemical composition of an Apollo 12 sample and attempting to recreate it in the lab by melting rocks and forming basalt. One of the really interesting parts about the Earth and Planetary Sciences Department is that all the professors that you take classes from are also doing cutting-edge research in their field. For example, Ray Arvidsson directs the Curiosity and Opportunity rovers on a daily or weekly basis on Mars, and Bill McKinnon has a principal role in the recent New Horizons mission to Pluto. I'm hoping to complete a PhD in planetary science. I chose EPS because you can really tailor your major to what you're interested in studying. You can take several different paths, such as geophysics, geochemistry, geology, so there's a lot of flexibility. This past semester, I had the opportunity to study abroad in New Zealand, in which I participated in a six-week-long field camp, and I also studied at the University of Canterbury for a semester. My favorite part about EPS is, it's a very small department, so you're able to form close bonds with the students as well as the professors. So people who graduate, many go on to pursue careers in research, some go on to do environmental policy, you can go to law school, you can continue going to graduate school, you could work for the government, so um, there are really so many options.